aim to uh, when you design a plane like this is to make it as maneuverable as maneuverable as possible, and uh, but therefore of course you sacrifice stability, and it means it's uh, it's like a Formula One car, uh, but you add a third dimension which is up and down, and you can flip the plane up and down. That's why we have a special oil system in the engine, a special fuel system, uh, and uh, the main aim for a plane like this is like a race bike or anything that is uh, supposed to be fast, accelerate fast to minimize the weight. This is the, of the utmost, utmost importance. Basically, these are very simple planes. It's one engine. The engine is a 9.5-liter uh, displacement, 320 horsepower, six-cylinder. It's air-cooled, fuel-injected, can run in any attitude. It has a 10 liters oil capacity, which shows that uh, the, the oil system is a very important part of the thing in order not to interrupt the lubrication. Then the, for aerobatics, the plane can take uh, 70 liters of fuel aboard, which is, uh, is good for about 40 minutes. And for ferry, we can put uh, another 220 in the wings. And um, yeah, basically, the whole plane is out of carbon fiber. It's all made in, in molds. It's a pretty, um, pretty expensive setup we, you, you need to, to uh, build an aircraft like this. So it, it's even more maneuverable. It can climb faster and descend faster and roll faster than, than the rest of the planes here in the field. It's a non-retractable ending gear, it's made of spring steel in order to absorb a lot of shock load. Then the wing itself is made from carbon fiber entirely. It's a wet layer made in a mold like, a, like the gliders. It's more or less the plane is German glider technology, most of it. The wing is, uh, including the ailerons and the spade arms and everything, is 75 kilos. Uh, the wing can be taken off for, by two people within 15 minutes and stowed into a container very easily. These are the control surfaces. This is for the roll control to make the fly plane turn like this. And if you look at the regular aeroplane, the ailerons are less than half the size of this, plus you have flaps. On these aeroplanes, it's all about control, so we don't have any flaps. So we sacrifice some landing speed. We touch down with uh, this plane with the 70 knots, and, uh, but therefore you have a lot of roll control. The plane, if you deflect the, full, uh, the stick fully at 200 knots, rolls about 450 degrees per second which is uh, more than once around in one second so we do four consecutive rolls it's really fast and a lot of fun it's made for um, 26 g's so and uh, the aerodynamic forces you can put on this maybe 14 15 if you really take it to the maximum but uh, regularly we put the limit to 10 g which is good enough for any sort of competition um, but basically the, these planes cannot break in the air so they are very very safe structurally so once you're used to it, it's very comfortable, you, you use almost no force, you just fly the plane by the fingertip and by feeling more or less. The ergonomics of the cockpit are designed for the high G environment, that means you must be comfortable strapped in, you must not move in order to be very precise in the controls. And uh, therefore we have uh, the control stick to move the roll and the pitch and the rudder pedals where you, which you use with the feet to, to uh, apply the yaw, which means you like, a, like in a car the steering wheel but uh, with a little more hefty reactions in case you use them wrong. Otherwise, the plane is pretty simple. It has a very simple electric system. Also, to reduce weight, it has only a small radio, small transponder to be able to fly legally in today's uh, crowded airspaces. But uh, it's definitely the absolute minimum equipment in order to keep it light. The cruise speed on this plane is around 200 knots. It's uh, 370 kilometers an hour. And uh, yeah, I said previously to go from uh, from this place to my home uh, near Berlin, it's a two hour, 40 minutes flight, non-stop, no problem, very comfortable. And I prefer this over any airliner for sure.